guys welcome back to my channel so I'm not gonna talk this whole video but I am gonna explain what I'm doing with my hair so I have put two braids in my hair like going down the side pulling the middle so that it's super flat and I'm just bobby pinning the sides now I'm gonna take some edge control and just dial down my edges this is the base that I like for this wig I feel like it's super duper flat with super low maintenance I took a wrap strip just to set my edges in place while I did my eyebrows and I'm just gonna put this wig on um, I did pluck this wig a little bit. It was a little too narrow for my liking, but it didn't take much work at all. I'm also going to use some concealer to super define the part and make it look extra natural. As far as, you know, coming out the box, I think it does come out the box looking good. I just personally wanted to tweak it just a little bit. So this video I'm going to be using products from samsbeauty.com, even the hair is from samsbeauty.com and all of the links to the items will be in the description box as well as the names of all the items that I'm going to use. So if you don't know what Sam's Beauty is, samsbeauty.com is basically an online beauty supply store. I love it because when I lived in Virginia, I didn't have a black beauty supply store by me if that's how you want to say it. Sally's is not a real beauty supply store in my opinion I need something that sells you know like plastic gold hoops and <laughs> all of my ratchet essentials so samesbeauty.com sells all of that and it's very very affordable I love shopping on samesbeauty.com I like I said when I was in Virginia and I didn't have a beauty supply store that is where I got all of my stuff they have braiding hair wigs makeup jewelry etc etc so definitely check them out if you have not already they are very affordable like I said and the shipping is very very fast so I'm not gonna be talking throughout this whole video you guys have watched enough of my makeup tutorials to basically know that I do kind of the same things you know with different products if you have any questions to something that I did not answer please leave me a comment in the comment section duh where else do you do the comment <laughs> and I will definitely get back to you guys as soon as possible in the meantime, follow me on my social media, which I will put on the screen right about now. And I love you guys so much. I'll talk to you more at the end of this video. Okay guys, so I just want to give you guys my opinion of some of these products. So a few of my favorites are definitely the contour kit by far. I have never owned a cream contour palette and I actually really really love this one, especially for the price. I am not a huge fan of the eyeshadow um, only because it does not have a matte shade to use as a transition color. I really don't like putting shimmers in my crease. But besides that, it's not a bad product and it came with a brush. I love the style of the lashes. They were a little difficult to put on because they were very straight. But I think it just might be this style of lashes because kids' lashes usually apply very well. 
I love the highlighter from Physicians Formula and I also love the foundation stick from NYX. Um, all the other products were pretty good. Um, the lipsticks were pretty. The names did not represent their color at all. The color that I ended up wearing um, was called Brown Honey and it's not brown <laughs> at all. But they're still very pretty. They dry down very matte and everything is very, very affordable. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to put all of the links to everything in the description box like I said. Um, and this is the last you're going to hear from me in this video. Make sure that you guys subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Please give this video a big thumbs up and leave me a comment down below. I want to talk to you guys. We haven't talked in a little while. Um, so I'm going to cue some slow-mo since the beginning of this video was me eating nachos. So I hope that you guys enjoy these slow-mos. I love y'all so much. And remember, in order to live your life to its fullest, you must live fearlessly. Bye, guys.